Hello, in the past 24 hours there has been an X-Class solar flare and earthquake activity has been normal. 24 hours ago yesterday at 20 UTC there was an X-Class solar flare as we can see on the graph here. It has since been followed by a few M-Class flares. We can view the latest SDO movies from NASA. On these images at 20 UTC, we can see the entire sun glow from this X-Class flare. NOAA has currently issued a warning for a geomagnetic storm of a K index of 4. This was issued at 1424 UTC today, which was 5 hours ago. Also, in the NOAA discussion, they list that on October 3rd to 5th, there is a chance for X-Class flares. Coming over to the Rajakins Ridge, the swarm has nearly stopped completely in the past 24 hours. There has been a magnitude 5.2 in that area. Yesterday at 1900 UTC, there was a magnitude 5.6 earthquake off the coast of Baja, California, near La Rivera, Mexico. Also in that area right now, making landfall is Tropical Storm Orlean. Looking at Northern Nevada and Southern California, we've had a few magnitude 3s in the past 24 hours. At 8 a.m. UTC today, there was a magnitude 3.1 near Yorba Linda, California. And then just 8 hours later, and not too far away, there was a magnitude 3.0 near Banning, California, and that was at 1608 UTC. Both of these earthquakes do have Did You Feel It reports. The larger one looks like it did not have a shake alert, and it also has 701 Did You Feel It responses on the USGS map. 1524 UTC today, there was a magnitude 3.1 earthquake just east of Winnemucca, Nevada. This earthquake has no Did You Feel It reports. Pulling up the BHE channel on seismograms in Southern California, on some of these stations we can see the signature of those two earthquakes in Southern California. Coming over to Hawaii, the amount of earthquakes has seemed to calm down just a little bit. However, the magnitude seems to have ticked up. There was an update released for Kilauea yesterday for HVO. And in this update, they do not note anything too significant, just that the eruption continues. And interestingly, SO2 levels are negligible or they're slightly lower than normal. Finally, we can take a look at Tropical Storm Orlean. Tropical Storm Orlean currently has wind speeds of 43 knots and it has made landfall in southwest Mexico. The National Hurricane Center has released a hurricane warning for mainland Mexico. They also say that flood and wind damage is likely. Thank you for checking out today's video and stay tuned for the next one.